aside being the owner and being responsible to put the Yankees back where they belong, he had a saying, if you do something nice for somebody and more than two people know about it, you didn't do it for the right reasons. Very, very sad. He's known all over the country. Everybody knows that John Steinbrenner, and uh, I don't know what to say. He made the Yankees who they are today. Seven World Series, crazy. My dad loves him. Oh, he just brought so many facets to the game, and, and the people who don't know what a human being he was, and you can find that out with the people he fought with the most. I just like the way he performed. He, he was a good boss. He was strict. I mean, he's hard-nosed, that's the way I believe doing things. With George, too much publicity was made in the 70s when, you know, he had his outbursts. And, but the one thing that I did hear on the news, he never took a penny out of that team. He would always put the money back in, and that's what made other owners crazy. He got some people, some other owners mad, but, you know, you gotta, you gotta live, you know, you gotta live with the facts, you know. Now, well, that's the way I look at it, you know. Doc Gooden signed with the Yankees in the 98 because he said George was interested in how I was feeling, what I was doing. He didn't take him back once, twice, three times. Daryl Strawberry, four times. You know, this is the way he was. Fired Billy Martin five times, took him back. He, he just cared about people. I'll probably lose two or three games off the bat, maybe. I'm hoping not, but... You know, with the All-Star game going tonight, it might, it might take a toll on the players. It's going to be very sad for everybody. Everybody in New York, everybody across the states. I mean, there's New Yorkers all over the place. So I'm sure everybody is going to be mourning him and, and pray for his family. Georgie, I love you.